thought I'd talk a little bit today about communications. Uh, several guys uh, from Yankee Prepper to uh, Southern Prepper 1 have had some excellent videos on communications. Uh, but one thing that I had kind of wondered, and since I have the opportunity here to, uh, to try it, um, I thought I would video it and put it up and show that you can in fact mix communications equipment from different countries. Uh, this particular unit here is a, uh, a German field phone unit um, and then this unit here is the TA-312 uh, which is an American piece of equipment. Um, the German unit I found is completely electrically powered. Now if somebody can show me how that this is sound powered and I just haven't figured it out uh, you know, please post a video and uh, and respond, because uh, I'd I'd really like to know that, uh, and so would a, a couple other people that I know. Um, the American unit is also electrically powered. Uh, the battery pack happens to be right here. However, you can use this as a sound only powered unit. What I discovered though is, to make them work together, you have to use batteries in both of them. Uh, you have to put the batteries in the, uh, the battery pack here and the battery pack here on the American unit. Otherwise, uh, they will ring each other, but you can't talk. Uh, both of them, however, happen to use uh, D batteries, so that is a, a commonality. Uh, I also thought that I would mention that you can get uh, basic wiring instructions for a, a net in uh, in the Army uh, Soldier's Manual and Trainer's Guide for uh, 11 Bravo, Charlie, Hotel, and Mike. Uh, skill levels 1, 2, 3, and 4, and it's sections 3-1 and a couple of sections afterwards showing you how to properly do that. Uh, this one happens to be, as you can see, uh, kind of an old manual. It kind of dates things, uh, but it, uh, the information is still uh, still accurate. Um, just to show you, uh, I'm going to ring the uh, American, or crank the American phone, and that's ringing the German phone. And for those of you who, uh, who are in, you'll recognize that sound. That's the uh, clacker on the, the TA-312. Uh, I don't really have a way of demonstrating that they will in fact talk to each other. Uh, and get it on audio. I kind of tried to do it a couple of times and it just didn't work. So I guess in that instance, you know, you just kind of have to take my word for it. Uh, it will work. Like I said, they, they will work together, but you will need to, uh, you will need to run the batteries on them. Uh, so I, I'm nearly certain that uh, a TA-1 won't work in this net. But, uh, you know, as long as you've uh, got electrically powered communications equipment like this, uh, you can mix and match the German units with uh, its U.S. counterpart, and it will work. So, you know, uh, at least for me, I, I've noticed that these 312s are a little bit harder to get. Uh, these German units are available. They're out there. Uh, so, you know, if you're looking for communications equipment, and you can't get all of one or you can't get all of the other or maybe one of your friends has got one and you've got the other uh, they will in fact work you just gotta run the batteries okay so uh, I just thought I'd put that out there and uh, thanks and have a good day